Pongo. Sorry, I step up my good girl, good Clara, good girl, good Missy, yeah, good girls. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I got him stopped so this car can go over this road load lane bridge is a one lane bridge. Ah, ah, ah. steady. Okay. How you doing? You. I'm doing well, thank you. Got my girls out for a walk. Well, I need you to go by my house and pick one up. Which house is that? Over there, uh, past the lake? Yeah. Yeah, I saw that out there. They're good. A little bit shorter than this payoff. I don't think it'd be much shorter than, than, than Clara there in the red. Uh, I bet he's a foot shorter. You think? Uh, don't need one quite that small. I gotta be able to use them for work. 
Take care. Everything's all right, girls. Go ahead on. Yeah, it's more girls. Good girls. Good girls. Go ahead, baby. You can cross it. Go on, Missy. Go on, baby. You've done it before. Go on, honey. Get up. Here we go. Go on, babies. Up we go. Missy, up. Get up. No, silly. Go on. You've crossed this. Go on, silly. Go on, get up. That's a good girl. Claire, you too. Get up. Good girls. Go on. Oops, what happened? Did something touch your nose? I bet it was a bug. Oh, my. Bugs on the nose. No, girls. Walk up. Hip, walk up. Go on. I'm going to have to get off this video so I can use my whole brain. Clara, step up there, honey. We are now the farthest away that I've ever been from home on the donkey tower. Up there on the right, right on the crest of the hill, as you hear it from here, that's a double mailbox, and that was what scared Missy and caused the big wreck for I got injured. Go on, Clara, you're good. Go on, Missy, you're good. Go on, girls. Up, up, up. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. There's somebody over there with a lawnmower, and that's true. But it's not too bad. And she's still worried about those mailboxes, but it's not the kind of worry she had when she was all by herself. So she'll walk on by. Her fear of that pair of mailboxes right there was what caused our wreck. They still worry her. She's spooked. You can tell if you're up if you're here looking at her clothes, you can tell she's spooked. But somehow, she's because of Clara's presence, she's able to stand it. It's funny, Clara's kind of spooked about the lawnmower, but this is not paying attention to that. We're heading back home now. Clara, go on. Go on. It's all right. So this is it, farthest we've ever been. I'm pleased. Well, we've been out about uh, pushing two hours. We went up, uh, up the road past where Missy and I had that bad wreck a few weeks ago. First time I've been back there since the wreck under Donkey Pal. They just don't spook the same when they're together as a team. A little bit of spooking happened out here, but it's not the same. It's not the blind panic that they get into when they're all by themselves. They draw comfort from one another's presence. I guess you could probably pull this cart by yourself. It's just a little bit heavier than our work cart, but not a whole lot. But it's just all together better with the team. Go on, Clara, you can do this. Oh, it's a pony. Go on, Clara, Clara, get up. Here, here, here. Missy, you know what. Go on. There we go. Good girl. 
can pass by about four or five cars. I like to come out here on the gravel roads where the cars are, are fewer. That's so that they don't have just zip, 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 zip one after another, but they still get passed and get experience in. I hear a tractor over on our right. I don't know what he's doing. Could even be a mower, but I think it's a tractor. He's got some things.